Drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel in the next 5 seconds if you guys want anything in today's item shop for absolutely free. You guys, welcome back to the channel and in today's video, I'm going to be going over the new V-Bucks challenges that will get you free V-Bucks within completing these challenges in Fortnite and when they will be coming out and what they do include within these challenges. So yeah, let's get into it. So as you know, I did a video yesterday about the Agent Giller skin and I'm not going to lie, I'm super excited for that skin to come out because it's going to be super cool. It is going to be one of the V-Buck challenge skins. So basically, once you purchase the skin, you get a set of challenges that do grant you V-Bucks and not, not a lot of people know how to complete these challenges and I'm going to be going over that in today's video and, and the amount of V-Bucks you will be able to get throughout these challenges. But we did get our new Deadpool challenges yesterday. So if you go to your new Deadpool section, they're quite cool. I'm not going to lie. I really do like them. As you can see, he's out the toilet now. And he is a controller player, everyone. He's a controller player. If you go here, you can see he was playing some Fortnite, which I find pretty funny. If you go into the computer, you have to scroll down and find Deadpool's toilet plunger. The way you can find this is you need to go into the agent section. Obviously, I did a video the other day about the... Uh, TNT team this thing you just got to go into a little place and as you can see the plunger is on the wall You just got to click that and then you have completed that challenge The next one is different destroyed toilets in a game. They're pretty easy. They're all in salty springs uh, You just got to go to certain houses uh, I think there's two downstairs and there's one upstairs in salty springs I'll put a cheat map on screen right now just to help you guys out So that's the new Deadpool challenges. Uh, they're pretty easy I'm not gonna lie. The challenges are pretty easy, but they're quite complicated in a way So obviously V bucks challenges have been out before if you guys do own the like the break skin or the uh, Fallen Love Ranger skin. I'll just go into my locker now. This is what the Fallen Love Ranger skin was. This is the first ever V-Bucks challenge skin you did get. Obviously, you get, this, you get the skin, you get the back bling that comes with it, and the, uh, the dark wings. They're sick. They're, uh, they're actually so sick. These wings, and then you get these set of challenges that do come with these. And you do get 1,000 V-Bucks that do come out of this challenge set, but they're, they spread across a whole week. So you can't just get 1,000 V-Bucks like instantly. You, they do spread across a whole week, which is quite a like, nice little effect. But the way you can actually complete these challenges when this Agent Giller skin does come out. So if you go to your Battle Pass section, I can see we've got all the new challenge boards. You've got the challenge table. This is where they might be stored. I'm not, not entirely sure where this is where the challenge is going to be stored. But if you go over to daily assignments, the challenges do consist of complete daily assignments. So obviously the first one is complete uh, one daily assignment or two daily assignments. And that's basically the first one completed. It's pretty easy. I'm not going to lie. But obviously your daily assignments change every single day. So you won't be able to complete all of them instantly which is quite a good I think I personally think the first one is complete daily assignments one so you basically just need to search chests or ammo boxes in salty springs and then kind of bada bing bada boom you've got your 100 V-Bucks for that day but then there's another one where complete daily assignments you got to complete three different daily assignments you can do that in a day as well they do come out daily the next challenge is complete five daily assignments this is where it's a bit tricky because obviously you get three daily assignments a day you'll have to complete this over two days and that will grant you 300 V-Bucks when completing Completing this and then the next one is complete daily assignments seven you have to complete seven different daily assignments that's going to take you three days to complete and that does grant you 400 v bucks within this new contract gear list skin i do like how they're doing these man i was expecting the skin just to be like in the item shop but it's going to be a whole new v bucks pack i'm super excited for them we don't know what challenges are going to be on the day but as you can see blow up a fishing spot with an explosive weapon basically shoot an rpg at the like the fish that jump out of the water and you get all the loot for it I quite like this. This is going to be the first V-Bucks challenge set throughout Chapter 2. So make sure you are picking this Agent Giller skin up. And if you guys don't have enough money to get it, I will be getting it for you guys. All you need to do to enter the giveaway is like the video, subscribe to the channel, put those post notifications on, and drop your epic in the comment section below. We finally got some of the new leak skins within the item shop. We've got the new Echo skin, which I think is super dope, man. This skin is so sick. Like, there's just different styles to hold the whole skin as well. Like, so you've got the black hair with the white, like, outfit. And then you've got the white hair with the black outfit. I like this skin. The glider's probably one of my favorite gliders in the game. I'm not sure, I'm not exactly sure why. I think it's just because of that matter in the middle of it. I really like how they've done that. And they do come with a white version as well. A white and blue version. Probably one of my favorite ones. I'm not going to lie. I might have to get this. But if you guys want anything from today's item shop, follow those steps to enter the giveaway. And the same as the battle pass. Because as you know, the battle pass is super sick this season. Probably going to be one of my last battle pass giveaways. Because I'm getting to get back onto the item shop giveaways. Because I know a lot of people want that. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.